Sawa. Hello class, welcome to our lesson again. Uh, your tutor is Roger Michira, ready to take you through the history class. Can you all be ready and set to learn? And today we get to look at the process of lawmaking. Remember, in our previous class, we did look at the types of bills. Now class, who can get reminders the types of bills we discussed in the last class? Good, we have the public, public bill. Good. We also have the private bill. Then again we say that a bill may originate from the National Assembly, good, and also the Senate. Now today we are now going to look at the process of lawmaking, right? From the draft bill to it making to it being a law. What do we expect at the end of the lesson class? We do expect that we are able to describe the stages through which a bill passes to become a law. Right. Remember, when it's a draft, it is a bill. Now, there's those stages it will, uh, it will, it will go through for it to become uh, a law. Now, the first, the first, the first stage, right? It is first reading. Now, remember, after it has been drafted, right? After it has been drafted, now it takes, to the, it goes to the first reading. Now, the bill is introduced in the house. Good. Now, it allows members to appoint themselves in the content. Yes, to debate. In this case, your first reading, deba debate is permitted at this stage. Now, the MPs are only required to approve or disapprove such intended legislation on the, country, uh, the country's law. Now, it is approved, it moves the second uh, reading. Now, le let me get to, to, to talk about that. The first reading, that is when now the bill is being tabled, right? In here, the members of parliament are allowed to debate, right? And also, they either approve or disapprove. If the bill is approved, it moves to the second reading. Good. Let's get to look at the second reading. What happens? Now, in this case here, the bill is debated in detail. Remember, in the first reading, it was just debated uh, uh, briefly. And also, it is either approved or disapproved. Now, after it has been approved, the second reading here, this is where we get the debate, detailed debate. Right? And again, in the second reading, amendments are also proposed. And suggested amendments are proposed and also suggested at this stage the bill can either be rejected or be discussed right or also it can be postponed for six months to give the con the concerned ministry time to draft the bill if the bill survives this stage it goes to the next stage now in here we, we can briefly say in the second reading deeper discussion are, are held right they can either now in this case here postpone uh, the bill for six months to allow the ministry to make uh, uh, to make to, to draft the bill yes uh, in this case yeah, i make more consideration on the on the on the suggestions that have been suggested good if, this, if if it survives the second reading it goes to the committee stage what what about the committee stage in the committee stage parliament turns itself into committee at the whole house or into smaller committees. Now, the, 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 the house can decide to uh, form smaller committees to discuss the bill or also discuss the bill as a house committee, as a whole, right? Now, they, 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 they get to review improvements on the bill and also make recommendations during the second reading. If it's a, from the uh, committee stage, it goes to the, the report stage. Now, report stage, this is when now from the committee's report back to the house. What were some of the recommendations? Right? What did you agree? Right? What improvements did you make to the bill? This is when now you get to report uh, from your committees. Right? And remember, it's the, cha the chairpersons of the committees who gets to report back to the, to the houses. Now, a report is being made from the, from the committees to the, to, the main, to the main house. From report state, it goes to third reading. Now, in third reading, Further debates are, uh, uh, takes place. Further debates takes place, right? Additional amendments may be, may be made on the bill. And again here, voting takes place, right? Voting. So if the bill survives, right? If, if, if a majority gets to agree, good. 
if the members approve it, pass to the next stage. Now, in this is a very crucial stage. This is where you see the members of parliament, the owner of the bill, gets to marshal members, gets to mobilize members to come and vote. We have always seen a number of times when the members are being uh, are being lured into into being given money, right? Now this is a way of mobilizing. The owner of the bill gets to mobilize the members of parliament to vote in for the bill. Thank you. From the third reading, the presidential assent, right? This is where the president now assents the law, right? It's the bill to become a law. Good. After the presidential assent, the bill becomes an act of parliament and one of the laws of the country. An act of parliament is an act of parliament is a law of the country. Now it is then published in the Kenya Gazette for public knowledge and awareness. Thank you, class. And for assignment, draw a flowchart depicting the stages, the stages a, a bill passes to become a law. And again, you need to take note on that. That uh, flowchart from the first reading, right, the presidential ascent, get, uh, get to draw that flowchart for you to, ma to make you understand much better. For reference, as always, it is evolving world, history and government. And this is a limited view, your favorite learning channel and your teacher was Roger Mishira. Thank you and let us get to see you in the next class.